statue of three Gopniks. <laughs> one of them, at least one of them was wearing Adidas. Welcome to the city of Grovd in Latvia. Smilsha Sculptor Parks Slacked. The park of sand sculptures is closed. Like I said, in Latvia we have the same kind of tranquil quietness like Gabriel Traveler is showing in his videos when he is back in the US. Look, a popular beach on a sunny weekend looks like this. Very quiet. Super quiet. It may only be my second time in this city, which is super close to Riga, the capital of Latvia. Only 40 minutes on a train. Now a super comfortable, nice modern train. And you are here in Jelgova. Let me take you on a little walk here. Okay, it's a dangerous beach, maybe that's why so few people sharp whatever you call it but the quality of water is ah okay I want to say great but no it's less than one star okay no I'm not going for a swim here 12 seconds later I'm going in. I mean, when am I going to have another chance to go swimming in a zero star beach? I actually don't know why <laughs> they allow you to go swimming if the water quality is considered unacceptable for swimming I don't know police boat oh, but it's so nice my first time ah, yuck. the bottom of the no my first time swimming this year in Latvia. Last time I was swimming in Thailand, Hua Hin. It's been a while. Una, are you going on a swim in this zero star beach? No. Not today. <gasps> oh wow, some. Dragon and piles of sand. Amazing. This is a small island here in the city center of Yelgova. The city center, I believe, is there. The bus station, train station, one tourist walking in our direction. Next, what do tourists do next? Una, please show us what do tourists coming to Yelgova do after a swim. It's very light.
the best, the best tourist attraction in Ielgavan. Now let's go and look for something different, maybe more mainstream than deadlifting 60 kilos. Seems like one of the best things about Yalgava is that you don't need to go swimming and snorkeling to see some weird stuff that looks like from the bottom of the ocean. There is some more of it and more. This is the city center on that side of the river. I had no idea that this building, this beautiful building, university, is now called the University of Biosciences and Technology. Latvian University of Biosciences and Technology. It used to be the University of Agriculture. I guess agriculture doesn't sound appealing to tourists, <laughs> to foreign students. What do you reckon? Where would you go and study? In the Agriculture University or University of Bioscience? The second one. Hotel Yelgava Here in the city center of Yelgava This is what city center of a rather big city in Latvia looks like on a sunny Saturday it's So unbelievably warm and nice actually hot now it would be also fine if it was like twice and it's colder also we are used to colder temperatures in September the Victory Street there across the street I see a shop called wine and other liquids very funny ah, and across the street is Boozy where that kid is taking his parents the boss. I think the last time I was here it was winter most likely and in summer the city looks much nicer. What a surprise. It seems to be a very Latvian thing and also East European that you build businesses in apartments, in apartment buildings. Just take the first floor apartment and rebuild it into a shop make a separate entrance Ruchit is dwarfy <laughs> only in Yelgova idea where we are right now but Google Maps is telling me that the train station is ahead of us so I guess some quieter street here in Yelgova city center 850 meters to the train station this is Pulkveža Oskara Kalpaka street then we are turning on the Stacijas street station street I guess the train station street this on the left is a typical apartment building 20, 30, 40 years old 
and this one on the right it looks like a same kind of building but renovated or maybe younger it may also be a younger building newer building and this on the left it looks very much like a kindergarten like I remember from my hometown but uh, I wasn't going to the kindergarten where are you Una going no, to no, 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 no. we grew on the streets in the hood so what is this okay some government institution or 650 meters to the train station let's see if we are going to have the new and modern train or the old one and we are back back at the train station right in front of which is this statue to the people who liberated Yalgova most likely during the Second World War. See you soon. Most likely from somewhere in Latvia. See ya.